I'm gonna do a quick unboxing here of the LG Watch Sport. Just got this here. Um, definitely uh, have had plenty of watches in the past. Um, have currently the Samsung and uh, did some other videos on those. So if you'd like to see the Samsung watch reviews, definitely check the card up on the top there and uh, we'll have those for you. So here's the LG designed with Google. Uh, so let's open this guy up. And then inside is the watch itself, which just pops right out of there. Definitely feels like it's a pretty big device. Put that aside, look how thick that is right there. Definitely is pretty large. And you take this off here. Underneath is instructions for it. Uh, quick start and so on. Uh, put that aside. You got your charging block right there. And you have a charger here that looks like it's encapsulated here inside of a plastic holder. A similar shape to the Samsung one for sure. So we'll pop this open down here. And it's definitely large. This is definitely much bigger than the Samsung one for sure. Much higher, definitely got a much definitely has a much deeper cavity in there for the watch to sit on. So, and like I said, this is a significantly sized device for sure. So, um, like I said, there's the cable block in there, and there's the actual cable there. So, charge block, sorry, and here's cable. And they also went with, oh, they went with USB-C, which is nice. With everything going to USB-C, it's nice that they actually did that here. And then you got your product warranty in the bottom there, so... So that's that. Let's go ahead and fire this guy up. Uh, see which button it is to power it on. It probably says it right here. Um, press and hold the power button, which is the middle button. There it goes, starting up. And it said Google. Now it's doing the Android Wear startup. And so what I'll do is I'll play around with this for about a week. And then I'll do my full review on it. So I'm um, kind of compare it to the Samsung watches that are on the market. Uh, the Gear S3, I've had that. had the Gear S2 as well as the Gear Sport. And as I said, you can... Look at the link to you know check out my other videos. I'll also put them in the description below, and uh, you know I definitely like the uh, the look of this to some degree that it has kind of that rugged look to it. But um, let's look at this in comparison, for example, to the um, the Gear Sport, and talk about what that might might look like real quick. So I'll lay this down flat and put the Gear Sport next to it. So the Gear Sport. Thickness wise, put them flat is probably maybe almost half the thickness. And this thing is definitely a beast. So um, hopefully that's helpful as far as giving you perspective there. Um, the band is clearly quite wide on here um, compared to this band, but I would say it's probably. Mm, you know, maybe it's 22, but let me just take a look here. But yeah, this guy is a beast. So let's see, tap to begin here. So I'm going to go ahead and um, tap on there. Gives you the various languages English, United States, oh, and so on. So I'll set this up. And like I say, just want to do a quick look at it real quick. And uh, I will, in fact, wear this for about a week or so and come back with my thoughts on it. Do you have this watch? Are you considering getting it? What do you think about it? Would love to hear your comments below and uh, subscribe for future videos and definitely browse around and take a look at my videos. And uh, you know, I hope this was helpful in comparison. And, you know, thanks again for watching. We'll see you on the next one.